Hi, I'm Doug here at Global West. Thought I'd take a second to talk to you about these control arms that are on the table. They happen to be for a 1962 through 65 Falcon, Comet, or Ranchero. Now these are a little bit different than a stock or standard type replacement, even though they're tubes. This happens to be a geometry kit, and it's a negative roll system, something that we produce for the Mustangs. Now what that basically means is we're changing the geometry curve of the camber, the way the tires sit. Instead of having a positive gain system when you go around a turn, these actually will generate a negative camber gain, which keeps the tire planted in the front end. A few things about these control arms. Normally, on a Ford control arm, the ball joint is in the center of the arm. So you got the center of the shaft, and you have the center of the line of the ball joint. Well, we don't do that on these particular control arms. These actually have three degrees of positive caster built into them. So if you look through center line here and you go through the center line of the ball joint, they're actually offset. So now we're going to have a right and a left. But we put caster into the control arm because on these particular cars, it's hard to get a lot of caster into them. And we like to see at least three degrees. So these arms have three degrees of positive caster pre-built into them. Now another thing is we're going to give you a template. Now this template is for relocating because we want to change the roll center on the front end. This is going to allow us to do it. The top two holes here are for the stock location where you bolt them in. And then you'll center punch on the two lowers. That's your relocation of where these arms are going to go. Now these arms are a little bit different width than a Mustang arm because a, a lot of people know that Mustang arms and Falcon arms are pretty much the same thing. Well, to a certain degree they are, but not when we get into this. The width here is slightly different on, on a Falcon arm than it is on a Mustang because of the way the towers are. The towers get a lot tighter when you start lowering that control arm. We have a plate here, as you see. This is a backing plate, and this, this is also used for alignment purposes. These arms are shorter. So on the initial installation, you're actually going to use that plate. The standard spring perch bolts on here. Your spring saddle goes right here spring comes down accordingly, okay? This distance from here to the center line of the ball joint has also changed somewhat. So your motion ratio has changed as well. Everything on these control arms is designed to make that car handle. It's similar to what we do with our Mustang negative roll, only again, this is for a Falcon or Ranchero. Now let me explain one more thing. I'm gonna turn around here and I'm gonna say, this here are gonna be our tires, okay? A positive camber gain system, like what the factory has, if I was going to make a left-hand turn, and these are my tires, the tires tilt out like this as you go around the turn. So that creates an understeer condition, making the car obviously go off the turn. But what this does is instead of having the positive camber gain, when you put these arms on, it's going to go like this. Loaded side goes negative, inside goes positive, which means it dig into the turn which is beneficial for handling. That's really what you want to do. Negative roll systems. That's why we call it a negative roll. We're changing that camber curve, okay? So the part number for this is at MNR463F, F standing for Falcon Ranchero, 62 through 65. It's a true negative roll system. We'll give you new alignment specs with it. If you use factory springs, you'll probably have to trim them to set your ride height. We offer springs for the Falcon as well and Rancheros. It's a little short of spring, performance springs. And shock absorbers wise, any shocks will plug right in. Whatever your spring saddle, uh, whether you have the bearing type or a factory spring saddle, it's not really an issue. So, negative roll systems, handling, not a drag race part. Great for street, great for autocross, gives you better tire wear. If you're building that Falcon or Ranchero, it's something you might want to check into.